Ghost of Mars 83. Thank you so much for tuning into my channel today. As you can tell, I'll be doing a product video, and I would like to firstly thank Cheap It and Dirt for actually sponsoring this video today. Brian from Cheap It and Dirt, thank you so much. It's definitely going to help me out while I'm creating my videos in the field. Uh, for those of you who have actually been following my YouTube channel, you know I started deer hunting back in 2014, started self hunting back in 2015, and I'm in the woods a lot. I am actually utilizing at this time approximately seven video cameras whenever I am in the woods. I have uh, six action cameras and one uh, 4K camcorder that I currently use. I do a lot of walking through the woods. I place my cameras at different locations, and this product here is definitely going to make it possible for me to make my way through the woods without getting uh, bitten by any mosquitoes or any other bugs that you know cause you a hard time whenever you're in the woods. If you would stand by for this video, I think you'll find it extremely useful. We're doing a product video on the MR450 Thermocell Insect Repellent. Now, let me explain something to you. The design of the MR450 is a lot better than the previous Thermocell. Now, I gotta tell you, the older models or the older designs, I really don't like them. The problem I have with this one, it didn't have a belt clip. It was, I have to <laughs> have to take it and hang it on my shirt. And I had to put some tape on the end so I wouldn't get scratched. This one here is going to be non-existent anymore. Not using it anymore. Okay? Done. Alright, now that we're talking about the MR450 Thermocell Insect Repellent, let's talk about some of the key features. It is rubber armored. It has a zone of protection indicator. It has an accessory mounting system. It has a redesigned grill. It has an ergonomic design. Repels mosquitoes, black flies, and other flying insects. Thermocell products create approximately a 15 by 15 zone of protection that lasts for hours. It also includes three original insect repellent mats lasting four hours each providing approximately 12 hours of insect repellency. It also uses a butane cartridge refill for mosquito repellent. Each cartridge lasts approximately 12 hours, is silent, virtually odor-free, no open flame. This is a product that you're going to definitely want. Now let's get to the unboxing. Whenever you receive your Thermocell MR450. Of course, it comes in a box that's going to resemble this one here. And you open it up, and this is what your product's going to look like. Uh, the first thing, of course, you're going to get your actual repeller, the MR450 repeller. Butane refill. the belt clip that goes on the thermocell, the battery, and three of the insect repellent mats. All right, so now the first thing I'm gonna do, I'm actually going to install the battery. I've been looking online and there are people who were having a hard time actually installing the battery, but it's pretty self-explanatory. It really is, to be honest with you. You're gonna have two screws on the back. You're gonna get you a pretty sharp Phillips head screwdriver. You're gonna unscrew the back off the thermocell itself. First screw here. And the second screw. You unscrew it. There's a little piece here, if you take your finger and peel it back, it'll pop right off, all right? When you look right in the back of this thermocell, when you look in the back, there's a little plastic piece here. You're going to take your finger, or if you want to, you can use a screwdriver, and just take and just peel it back just a little bit, and just take and slide it back. It comes completely out. This drawer, you're going to place your battery, all right? The battery is going to go inside of the little plastic holder with the positive side down. On the actual plastic piece, it, show, it, it has a plus. So again, you put the positive with the positive here. And then you're going to take your 
battery holder and your battery and you're going to slide it into the thermal cell. All right. It's successfully installed. You're going to take the plastic back for your thermal cell, put it back on the thermal cell, take these two screws and you're going to screw it back in. One side in, be the second side. All right, now the battery is installed. Now with the insect repellent mats, I'm actually not going to put one on right now because uh, <laughs> I'm not going out in the field. But what you do is you're going to tear one of these packs open. You're going to take your insect repellent or your insect repellent pad, whatever you like to call it, and it slides right into your thermal cell just like this. Now the next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna install your butane cartridge. You're gonna pop the top off, okay? Slide it in the bottom of your thermal cell, and you're gonna screw it in just like this right here, okay? Screw it in, and you can put your, put your cover back on, all right? Now, the, the thing I like most about this thermal cell is the belt clip. This is going to make it so much easier for me to transport it through the woods and not have to worry about clipping it on my shirt with a wire hanger. To put this on your thermal cell, to install your belt clip, you simply, the two little slide pieces, you slide it on the thermal cell as such, push up on the actual clip itself and slide it in. It's successfully installed. That's it. Again, I'm going to show you how to do it again. I'm going to take it off the belt clip, slide it into your thermal cell like this, and slide it up. It's installed. Now, I'm going to show you how to start it. To start, only thing you do is take it and you pull this little lever to the right. You can hear it getting itself ready to go. I normally let mine sit maybe five to ten seconds. And then what you do, you press the start button here. And what I do to make sure it's started, you can see it actually glowing at the tip of your thermal cell. Once this thing heats up, this light's going to turn blue. So now that I actually have the thermal cell on, it is now up to the desired temperature. And the difference is, if you actually look at it, that blue indicator light is on. Now. Let me explain something to you. Whenever this indicator light pops on, you will hear it. It's not really loud, but it's letting you know that, hey, listen, the desired temperatures uh, has been reached and it will pop on. Uh, this right here is probably one of the best thermal cells that they have created thus far. This is one of the only ones I've actually tested, but when it comes to the personal use uh, of something small to be transported through the woods, this is gonna be the product here. I would highly recommend this product to anyone I cannot wait to start using it for uh, turkey season because as it is now, we are currently in deer season and the mosquitoes are really not bad because the temperatures dropped. Now I have had to use my older thermos cell prior to me creating this video. It did work, but I can't. I cannot wait to start using this one. Again, Brian from Cheaper Than Dirt, thank you so much. Again, if you all are interested in this product, I would highly suggest you check out my video description. The link to this product is definitely displayed below if you are a hunter you camp or you want to have something outside to protect you against those mosquitoes and all those other insects that bite and pester you while you're outside i would highly suggest you get one of these again cheap it in there thank you so much for sponsoring this video today again until next time ghost of mars out